I thought I would seize the moment why Mama wasn't in here. Well, she's next to him, but she's not in there with them, so I thought we'd get some good footage of them. This is the little Sphinx boy. This is a little Sphinx girl, all crashed out, and then the little one, it took her 36 hours to bless us with her presence. She's a little Bambino girl, and she's a little smaller than the others, but her brother, who took almost a day, who is also a little Bambino boy, he was a big one. He was 4. Point, I think it was 4.1 or 4.2 ounces whenever he was born, which is a little bigger than what we're used to seeing. I think he slowed everything down. But everybody's doing really great. Everybody's got great color. They're gaining weight. They're nice and pink and everything's just going really well. We're very, very fortunate because we weren't so sure it was going to turn out that way. But it was a 36-hour delivery with a happy ending. Mama and babies are doing fantastic. We're so happy. What's she dreaming about? Clenching her feet everywhere. Let me pick one up in my hand so you can kind of gauge. I'll pick up the little cutie pie. Our little miracle baby. Hmm, <laughs> her little umbilical cord there. Let's see if I can get her turned here. Hi, pretty girl. So tiny. You're so tiny. Handsome little Bambino boy. I'm so cute. Yes, you are. You got a precious little face. Let me switch hands here. And then the little girl. Here comes Mama. Why are you touching my babies? Oh, those beautiful long legs. She's smelling me. You're not my mama. There you go. There she is. Oh, little Mr. Kipling. You gonna show us your big boys? So handsome. He's the biggest. Yes, yes. He says, I know it. Just call me Hercules. Handsome little man. Yes, he is. Oh, mama. You're such a good mama. You're such a good mama. You only rub your tummy. Yes. You about feel good. Mm-hmm. Well, welcome, babies. We sure do. Hmm. I'm stretching. <laughs> Happy birthday.